Cubbies, it's Black China Bear. Today is February 19, 2019. If you don't know, today is my birthday. Yay! It's my birthday, it's my birthday. And I wanted to come on here and share it with you guys. I never get a chance to do that, and I wanted to do that today. Today is something huge. As you guys know, I said I was gonna come on here and cut off my hair, and I'm gonna be doing that today. Uh, also, I wanted to address those of you that have been inboxing me, asking me about sending me um, presents to my P.O. box and whatever. I actually do not have a P.O. box. So if you want to send me um, a present or anything like that, um, my cash app is Black China Bear. I'll put it on the screen here. Or if you want to send me like an e-gift card, like Target, Sephora, what, wherever, Forever 21, wherever you guys. I don't care if it's like $5, $20, whatever. Um, but feel free to inbox me. It is uh, blackchinabear at gmail.com for my email. So if you want to send me some kind of electronic gift, feel free to. If God's putting me on your heart. If you know, if you don't feel like it, you ain't got to. I'm not like blackballing anybody or anything like that. But those that want to send me a gift, you definitely can feel free to. So today's video is going to be about cutting off my hair. <laughs> Guys, I'm not going to lie and say I am not terrified. Like, I have been going back and forth with my hair for many years. You guys know this. I've tried big chopping before, but I've never actually went ahead and just cut off my hair. And it was so funny. I was going to do this video live. Um, I was going to live stream it and just cut off my hair. But as I was taking a shower this morning, I was praying, talking to God. And God was talking to me. This is so spiritual um, I've been clinging to my hair for a long time it's so damaged you guys my hair grows it grows and grows and grows and then it breaks off it breaks off it breaks off and God was talking to me he was saying this is what we do we cling to those broken and damaged things cling to those things we have no business having or being a part of or keeping a hold of and God is asking us to let them go and we just keep holding on to them because we're so afraid. We're so afraid to let go. We're so afraid to trust. We're so afraid to try something new. We're so afraid to believe that God has something better for us on the other side. And we keep holding on to those things. We keep doing those old habits. Keep talking to those same old people that we know a long time ago we should have let go. And God has been asking us a long time to let go. Let go, let go. And so I've been clinging to this hair and my new hair keeps growing and the old hair keeps breaking off. So my hair never grows past like this point right here. And I see the damage. I see the damage. I keep having this hope that my hair is gonna be long and healthy and it keeps dying and breaking off and breaking off and breaking off. It's the same thing for us in the spiritual and the natural. We want these great things. We want these beautiful gifts. And we keep clinging to these things that are doing us harm, that are no good for us, that are spiritually damaging, that are naturally damaging. They're damaging us mentally, physically, spiritually, financially. And God is saying, let go, let go, let go. And I've been hearing that a lot lately. Let go, let go. And I keep thinking of that Elsa song from Frozen. I've never seen Frozen, you guys. Never seen Frozen, but I know that let go song because I've heard it a million times. So I'm like... That's my mantra for 2019, let go. And like, it, it has been a great year so far. Like guys, I have, I've had so many bad years back to back. But 2019 so far has been so amazing. And I keep looking to God in expectation, like God do a great thing, do a great thing. And it's so on time for me to do this because I'm believing God to do a great thing. So I'm just gonna go ahead, let go of this little bit of damage hair that I have on my head. I'm not cutting my hair off for it to be a style, you know, so me walk around ball like, you know, we'll have a style. I'm just cutting it off because I want to let go of this damaged hair and let some healthy hair come in. So I'm not going to be cutting it into like some kind of fade, like I don't even know how to do all that. I'm just going to shave it off. So without further ado, let's jump right into that. I'll never be the same I'll never be the same oh, 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 oh,
is officially gone. It's funny, you don't realize how much it is until it's cut off. So all of it is cut off. It feels so, I feel so weird. I'm not gonna lie, I feel so freaking weird. I am not used to this. This is the first time I have ever felt my head like this and it's weird. <sighs> I don't know what the back looks like because, of course, I can't see the back, but I, I just wanted to make sure all of the hair was off. So, my plan with growing my hair back is to make sure to get my scalp really healthy. Um, I have the Sulfur 8. My mom used to use this on me when I was a kid, so I wanted to go back to old school products. Um, I have Blue Magic Hair Grease, and I have the Wild Growth Oil. Um, I don't know what shampoo slash conditioner I'm going to be using yet. I have to figure that out. Um, I'm, I'm going to use different products in my hair to see what works best. I, I do use biotin, so I'm going to continue using that. I'm going to learn as I go. So guys, this is the final product. I love you guys so much. Thank you for supporting me and loving me. I hope that this video was really helpful and encouraging you. And I hope that you guys have a great 2019. And thank you so much for all the birthday wishes. They mean so much to me. I am so, so happy to be here another year. But I love you guys so much. I will catch you in the next video. Until then, stay fierce, stay fabulous. Black China Bear. Mwah. Bye.